Hey everybody, welcome back to Keeping Up with the Vineyard. My name is Claire and today I'm with Greg Boger. And it looks like we got a little bit of a water show going on today, Greg. We do. We're starting our first <laughs> irrigation here in early July. Nice, uh, we nice. Have, we have neutron probes that tell us, uh, what, that measures the hydrogen ion or water content down to four feet. Mm -hmm. And when it predicts we need to irrigate, we turn on the sprinklers. Sprinklers in this case, mm -hmm. because this is my one of my first vineyards planted in 75. Oh, wow. Before drip irrigation was really uh, well established. Mm -hmm. All of mm -hmm. our new vineyards use a combination of drip and overheads. But nice. the overheads have a lot of advantages. Uh, it keeps the vine cool. It washes off dust and mm -hmm. pesticides if you need. Mm -hmm. And uh, and it also gives a full soil profile mm -hmm. of uh, of, uh, of moisture so we keep a cover crop healthy and growing throughout the year. So anyway, Fantastic. that's that's uh, one of the many reasons we use sprinklers besides frost mm -hmm. protection. Fantastic, okay. absolutely. Well, if you guys are looking to cool down, come visit us while we're irrigating this weekend. <laughs> but right now, that's keeping up with the vineyard. We'll see you guys soon.